So hello my friends, Devon Lennox here, Photography PX. In today's video we'll cover the best flash diffusers. Do you know you can find timestamps and links in the description down below as well as the pinned comment. And also know this is not a sponsored video. Let's get started. Flash diffusers are essential in the photographer's arsenal to avoid the otherwise harsh direct light produced by most standalone flash units. Sure, you can sometimes bounce a bare flash off a wall or ceiling to soften it, but that's not always possible. Dark or strange colored walls, high ceilings, or shooting outdoors are all instances when this is not actually useful. And the last thing you want is to use the flash on its own, which produces a ghastly overexposed startling look to your subjects. Ouch, that's an effect that's rarely appealing or flattering. In comes a flash diffuser, which gives photographers utmost control over their lighting. A flash diffuser is a style of modifier that diffuses the light source, softening its effect. So you can light subjects with a flattering light with gradual transitions. And these cost-effective accessories can go a long way in creating natural looking light, sidestepping the harshness and shadows normally present. But there are many aspects to consider when it comes to flash diffusers, ranging from their compatibility, the type, diffusion material, and their size. With that, we've compiled a brief guide outlining the factors to look into when considering flash diffusers, which you can find in the pinned comment down below, and we'll also cover the best flash diffusers on the present market. Coming at number five, Round Flash's Magnetic Ring Flash. Round Flash's Magnetic Ring Flash Diffuser is a universal modifier ready to fit most camera and flash combinations. And rather than attaching to the flash itself, like most traditional modifiers, Round Flash has opted to create an enormous ring flash instead. Measuring 17 inches in diameter, it wraps around the entire camera camera using the hot shoe. Doing so greatly amplifies the size of the flash unit, and it turns a traditional speed light into a fully functional ring flash, producing smooth and even lighting without any hot spots, and it effectively creates a shadowless fill light in the process. Yet at only 12 ounces, the kit is ultra lightweight and folds up neatly for storage. As such, it's a must for photographers wanting to light portraits with the infamous lighting effect only a ring light provides, but it's also an excellent option for product or mass macro photographers wanting a simple yet large format option. Coming in number 4, Magmod's Starter Kit. Magmod's Starter Kit is an all-in-one solution aimed to improve your flash photography. This kit features three items, the Mag Grip, the Mag Sphere, and the Mag Grid. The Mag Sphere is a dome diffuser that diffuses the harsh lighting from the flash unit into a soft omnidirectional glow, while the Mag Grid is a grid spot that focuses the light from the flash into a 40 degree beam pattern, great for adding an accent light in the background. And it's an excellent tool to add precise lighting into the scene with a minimal spill. And yet you can also stack multiple Mag Grids to create a tighter 20 degree or 15 degree beam angle if desired. Both of these accessories connect to the Mag Grip which is a base plate of sorts. The grip attaches directly to most flash heads and links to their other accessories magnetically, creating a seamless modular system. And all of the accessories are simple to use and hassle-free, yet together they only weigh 553 grams or 1.2 pounds, so it's unlikely to add much bulk and weight to your flash or your setup. As such, this kit is a must for photographers wanting something flexible, but robust and straightforward to use. Coming in number three, Altura Photos Softbox Diffuser. Altura's Universal Softbox is their top-selling diffuse softbox for shoe-mounted flash units. They offer this diffuser in three sizes ranging from 5 to 8 inches wide, so you have some flexibility in how much diffusion occurs, but each model uses an integrated hook and loop fastener strap to attach them to most flash heads. They also collapse for easy storing in the included storage pouch, but when attached they produce even lighting by using a two-layer diffusion, and doing so softens the harshness of a bare flash unit. However, the advantage is that the 8-inch model specifically offers excellent distribution given that it has an extended shaft, and this modifier is a must for photographers wanting a simple and affordable means to improve their lighting. Coming in number 2, Gary Fong's Lightsphere. Gary Fong's Lightsphere is a long-standing classic modifier for improving flash photography. The Lightsphere is a translucent dome modifier that diffuses the flash omnidirectionally, but it also features vertical rings ensuring even illumination and minimizing power loss, so much so it can light up an entire small room, eliminating many unwanted shadows with a soft light in the process. In addition, it connects to most flash units using a Velcro strap for a snug fit, and it's a must for photographers wanting a simple system ready to capture group shots. Coming in number one, Rogue's Flash Bender. 
Rogue's Flashbender, now on its third generation, continues refining this class-leading modifier. The Flashbender comes in five variations, including reflectors, softboxes, and a complete lighting system. The large softbox kit in particular offers the best versatility though. It measures 11 inches in size and attaches to most flash units using a quick release buckle and an attachment strap, and it collapses and folds neatly for easy traveling, saving valuable space in the process. But with such a large size, it produces soft directional light and a light that you can mold and shape to conserve precious battery life rather than scattering it all around unnecessarily. You can also use the flash bender as a large shapeable reflector, perfect for bouncing the light onto the ceiling or great for off-camera flash photography as a gobo or snoop. As such, it's a must for photographers wanting a more powerful tool that outdoes most traditional diffusers, especially outdoors, but a tool that also offers more flexibility and directionality to boot. So there you have it, my friends. There's our list of the best flash diffusers. For more information, check out our website, photographypx.com. You can also look at the pinned comment in the description down below, and I'll take you right to the full post. I've been your host, Devon Lennox. We'll see you in the next video. Thank you for watching today's video. I hope you found the contents of today's video insightful and it added value to you. If you're new here, please consider subscribing if you haven't done so already. Also, leave us a like and a comment in the description down below. Let us know if we overlook something or we miss something that we covered in today's video. I've been your host, Devon Lennox, photography. <laughs>